Creed and Zary, and we're back with another read aloud. And as you can see, this is the good egg. Just take a look at the picture for a little. We get the good egg by Joy John and P. Oswald from the creators of Bad of the Bad Seed. Oh, hello! I was just rescuing this cat. Know why? Because I'm a good egg. A very good egg. It's true. I do all kinds of good things. Like, I'll carry your groceries. I'll water your plants. I'll sand your tires. I'll paint your house. If you need any help, I'm what's whatsoever. I'm your egg. I've always been a good egg. It's been this way from the start. Even in my earliest days, farmers market. Even in my earliest days, Back at the store. There were a dozen of us living together under one recycled roof. There was Meg and Peg and Greg and Clegg and Sel and Selly and Selden and Selby and Egbert and Frank and other Frank. Frank sounds weird. The other 11 eggs weren't on their best behavior. They weren't exactly good. They ignored their bedtime. They only ate sugary cereal. They threw tantrums. They cried for no reason. They broke their stuff on purpose. Wait, why is he crying? Oh yeah, they said he cried for no reason. Meanwhile, I tried to take charge. I tried to fix their bad behavior. I, I tried to keep the peace because I was a good egg. A very good egg. Nobody seemed to care, though. Every night, I was exhausted. My head felt scrambled. Then one fateful morning, I noticed some cracks in my shell. Yikes, they were everywhere. I think he had the cracks cause, you know, the sign kicked me. I think somebody kicked him. My doctor said it was from all the pressure I was putting on myself. The pressure of making sure everybody was a good, as good as me. Yolk, they have yolk instead of blood. I was cracking up. Literally, something bad. Something had to change. I'd had enough. I told Meg and Peg and Greg and Clegg and Sel and Selly and Selden and Selby and Egbert and Frank and other Frank that I was leaving. I can't be the only good egg in a carton. I said, blah, 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 they replied. I left that night. I wandered from town to town. The hours became days. The days became weeks. I lost track of time. I was alone. Out there on the road under the stars, I really tried to focus on myself and what I needed. I took walks. I read books. I, f I floated in the river. I wrote in my journal. I found simple moments to be quiet. I breathed in. I breathed out. And I even started painting.
for once, I found time for me. And guess what? Little by little, the cracks in my shell started to heal. My head no longer felt scrambled. I started to feel like me again. Oh my gosh, those rocks are literally like, what, 10 pounds? And she's just a simple egg. So I've made a big decision. I'm returning to my old carton and my friends. Besides, I'm kind of lonely out there. This time, I know what I need to do. I'll try not to worry so much. I'll, good, I'll be good to my fellow eggs while also being good to myself. Here we go. Everyone missed me. I miss them too. Welcome home. Hello, Meg. Howdy, Peg. Hey, Greg. Greetings, Clegg. What's up, Cell? Oh, hola, Selly. Hey, oh, Selden. Hey, Selby. Good day, Egbert. What's happening, Frank? How do you do, other Frank? Sure, every once in a while, somebody's still a little bit bad, but it's not like before. Here's what I realized. The other eggs aren't perfect, and I don't have to be either. I'm okay with that. Yep, the old curtain is back together. We're a solid dozen again. It's good to be home. I like this, this book, The Good Egg, because he feels a lot of pressure to be perfect because I, I also feel pressure to be perfect. And the good egg is the opposite of the bad seed. This book, The Good Egg, made me realize that I don't have to be perfect. And what I also like about this book is that the good, the good egg is really cute. With the bad seed. Oh, he was terrifying. So, that will be it for today. So, um, I hope you have a good day, and I hope you have a good week. Bye, everybody. And don't forget to like and subscribe, and share it with your friends.